Java. Mm. <laughs> so, <laughs> the song. <laughs> so let me introduce you guys. Uh -huh. You guys, welcome back again to the Why in the Morning show. My name is Joy Mochache. You can reach me on Y underscore Mochache on Twitter. And you can also tune in and reach our guests as well as this channel on Facebook. That is Y254 channel on Instagram as well on Y254 underscore channel. And on Twitter, you can reach them on Y254 channel. And don't forget to tune into YouTube and catch all the videos and everything streaming live. That is Y254 channel as well. We'd love you guys to, you know, be friends with us. Give us your input, Maze. Give us, give us that morale to keep going, to keep airing these things out to you guys. So bef before we go any further, I've got two guys on over here who've just done spoken word. One was playing a guitar. What's your name, sir? I'm Javan. Javan. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's nice. Mm -hmm. What are you? What exactly would you call your profession? Uh, as a small, my profession has the power of the tongue. Power of the tongue. <laughs> yeah. Okay. As in, mean your what's idea lyrics? Zach is a poetry marinate. Okay. Zak is a I wanna say the is a sink in Vizuri. Ah, okay. So mm. so and okay, we know you're crazy monafunzi. Yeah. Yes, but I also want you to let people know, apart from crazy monafunzi, what is the other name you feel like other people should know? Yeah, so I go by the names Crazy Monafunzi and I'm the ghetto prince, you know. I was ghetto born and prince. raised in Dandora. Okay. It's a ghetto, so I'm not a king, you know, you, you know everybody calls he himself the king, king, Taka, everybody. So we mm -hmm. just decided to be the prince. Okay, ghetto prince. I'm the ghetto prince. Because mm, you're from the ghetto. I'm from the ghetto. Proudly. I'm proud, I'm a proud ghettonarian. <laughs> <laughs> so you're not forgetting where you come I'm from. I'm not forgetting where I come from. That's from. important in this industry. Very true. Yeah, that's very, very important. It keeps you on the right path. Ve and I, I always follow that and I just want to be like a motivation from the people at the gate so that when they see me they see like yeah you can make it okay yeah oh, it's our, it's our. Yeah. i like the way you dress your get up explains a lot about <laughs> you, you know, it's a, it stands out uh, you're not the kawaida that we see or see on the streets just like anyone no, you have your own style and i like it yeah me i just don't follow trends i make trends so. you <laughs> you make trends yeah okay sir i don't like me i don't follow trends i just wear what i want you wear what you want yeah. whether or not you've seen someone wearing it I ju my, you know, like uh, my, like what, uh, 2019, my vibe is all about simplicity is wisdom. Simplicity is wisdom. Yeah, that's my vibe. Okay. Yeah. Sawa, sawa. Now let's talk about what you are. <sighs> when you were doing spoken word, was that something that you had pre-written? Something you looked at before or that's something that you thought of just now? Yeah, uh, like I had pre-written, mm -hmm. but it's mostly it's it's it inspired by the things that I see like in daily life routine. Okay. Like I get in a matatu, like there, like there was a line I was saying, one squeeze one of funga mishipi. Like I know I'm to one of funga safety belt, then I get a line. Like na 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 yanda na tembi ako street, na I'm to one of funga kitu I get a line. Hmm. So like it's like you could lines go everywhere. I mas, I just get them from random places, but when does yandika down, then I just make a piece out of it. Make a piece out of it. Yeah. So it's everyday life. Everyday life. Okay. What's your how can I say your favorite piece? That one piece that you've written and you said, "Hey, Maze, this one. Mm, this is the one." Ah, okay. What What is it about? Yeah, okay. And What's the one. general gist of it? Firstly, I'll say you know every piece from the master is a masterpiece. Okay. So, but, <laughs> but hey, you have a way with words. <laughs> hey, you have a way with words. Yeah. So, uh -huh. but there's this one piece I wrote. It's called Love Fabet. Love for Love Fabet. It's okay. love. And alphabet together. It's now it's known as alphabet. Okay. Actually, when I first when I was writing it, it wasn't like I was like just having fun. Mm. I was just playing with the alphabets. Okay. Then I did my first show. It went like viral. People were like, "We need that one." That even when I said I was coming here today, I just wrote which piece should I perform. Everybody like my social media is like alphabet, 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 alphabet. Mm. Like people love it that much. People love it that much, yeah. it, but that's not the one you performed. Well, that's not, yeah. I'll do it on the other set. Okay, you do on the other set. Yeah. Okay. Sawa, like sawa. we have, like we have another one. Then we'll do the love of it. Okay. Yeah. Sawa, sawa. And Javan, let me ask you: When did you guys come together? How how did you decide that? Hey, yeah, you know, this thing can gel well. Mink is a guitar, no okay This thing can gel properly. And as I said, I'm a crazy journey. Okay. We learn crazy. And as I said, I'm Ilianza fani nilikutana na yeye nilikuwa namwacha by the way kwa tele kwa TV 
then the moja nikienda um, Churchill nikamkuta huko alikuwa anaenda ku ku present huko mbele Churchill okay. so nikamkuta nikamwambia eh hey, ni aje crazy mucha za violin hiyo time sikusema gita akaniambia okay come nayo the flani KNT tunaka tunaweza fanya staff 1 2 3 nika come nayo but please nilicheza huko mnaisa akamza nini nyingine wewe bro nikamwambia mucha za gita so akaniambia ni aje come nayo so then nilikuja na gita na pia nilikuwa na bishti yangu fulani aitwa Harris so nikakaa nika, nika akasikia vile naicheza kwanza ilikuwa ngoma ya ma, m, Mariu ya damu so aka nice akaniambia niaje tunaweza waka the next thing nasikia akanikola akaniambia kamta mm. na hivyo ndio ilikuwa ah so you also play the violin yeah. eh, what did you learn eh <laughs> hey, ni nimekapitia nilianza ku learn kwa street then nikapitia sauti academy oh, yani ulijifundisha yeah alafu sasa ndio kwenda shule. Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> I love people who teach themselves these things. <laughs> I must say mm. I really admire that. Uh, but cuz I love instruments mm. and um nimekuwa na hiyo interest sana lakini I'm like ah, now at this age nezaanza kweli. Eh kula instruments ngumu. Si ngumu? Si ngumu. But then mimi hata si gita nilianza nao by then nilianza na piano. Then do Tena pia piano. Hebu yeah, hebu sema list mzima basi. Eh, ah, Tuambie <laughs> list yote. Hapana <laughs> ni hizo tu tatu. Oh piano, violin, yeah, guitar. Yeah, okay. Saxophone sijaiba sana. Saxophone kidogo hapo. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Mm. Hey, that's amazing. Niko kidogo jealous, I can't lie. Nasema ngaye ni player. Yeye ni player. Yeye ni player because anaweza cheza hizo zote. Pia kuna vitu zingine kuna kitu nyingine anaweza cheza. Watu kidogo <laughs> 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 Right you like for real like if you are a big brand yeah like uko na shows una time ya kuandika content uh-huh. so like wana call ni aje unaanza njengea show so you just write then unampatia ana memorize then anafanya show eh manze ah so you you have a way with words that yeah, are jokes yeah and you know like like lines zuko everywhere that's why tunaona ameongelea kuhusu kucheza play kaka mm. like it's everywhere you don't need to tafuta Mm, it's just around you. Yeah, ni wewe wenye utaiona. Alafu sasa hiki tu, wewe ulianza at what age? Eh like mimi personally, yangu ilikuwa fani. I mimi husema hivi watu wanakosa kuamini. I was a footballer. I'm, I'm a really really good footballer. Oh, really really I'm, really I'm, good. I'm dope. Nime travel three times outside the country playing football. Where did you go? I, to Norway two times. Wow. Yeah. What were you playing at Norway? I was playing for Mathare Youth Sports Association, Maisa. And I started in under 16. That's amazing. Yeah, so I was a really really talented footballer but then my coach was like alikuwa good with words. Like alikuwa anajua ile kutu inspire. Alikuwa anakaa anasema hivi anasema hivi anasema hivi. So like kila time nilikuwa nasikia kitu amesema mimi nanibamba. Naenda na post social media. So nikakaa siku moja nikasema mimi pia sinaweza kuomse. So nikaanza even though lines zangu zilianza kukaa. So pole pole nikajipata naandika 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 na nilikuwa pia player kama mzee. Ah. So mimi nikaandika lines then nika perform na now here we are. Wa so now football not happened to football. Football. Ni dunia ni sasa ukaka tu huko nyuma ukacha na. Sasa ni kwa PS. So mzee unikuta kwa nyumba nicheza PS. Hivi tu mzee. Ah yes, mzee anacheza tu kwa PS cuz unajua pia ni na mkiumia pia ngori. So mm. like uh, sahili bagi tuni PS but football I don't play when I just took PS. Mm, okay. And then sir you said that was around 16 years old. Yeah, I was 16. Then sasa ndo nikaanza sasa poetry, my mm. poetry journey kaanza mm. pole pole. Mm. I met some people along the way wakanishika shika mkono. Okay. Eh yeah, so like um, watu kama wagani like kama tunaweza actually na uh, ni poet aniseme hapa manze rest in peace bruzo diambo. Ah, okay. Bruzo Diambo was the person that discovered crazy monophones. Wow. He's the one that saw the talent. He's the one like kuna yeah, he performed kulikuwa na watu. I performed nobody approached me alikama akanipea business card na akanipeleka majuu for 2 years. Akaniambia niaje nataka hiki tu unafanya uende ukafanye huko nje watu waone. And and yeye ndiye alinifundisha aliniambia usiwai change to hiyo kizungu. I want you to do the shang. Alikuwa ananitanga kala mashaka. 
kala mashaka yeah, I used to kama ulikuwa tunajua eh kama kala mashaka like alikuwa anasema i'll be the next kala mashaka you know because yeah. kala mashaka says no more so alikuwa anapenda kunita kala mashaka so alindi alikuwa ananiambia tu crazy mwanafunzi just keep doing what you doing na akanipeleka majuna na sahi tuko hapa mazee alinifanya like nikafanya tours Kenya nini nini na sahi na sema tu so sad kwa na familia RIP mazee kesho tuko pale old saints fundraising yake na mazee kama mtu yote anaweza tokea mazee tukam celebrate life yo mse he was a great producer alikuwa na produce yake na sauti soul so like bruce the thambo kama uko unamjua mazee let's come show love wow wow Wow, you so you you really remember the relationship you guys had. Yeah, you were like for me kwangu, I was missing your wife like I would never sing you anywhere bila Bruce the Ambo. He was like mimi nilikuwa na hata kwa simu nilikuwa nimemsave ule mse. Yeah. Like ali he made me like who I am. He told I'll go and guide fanya hii fanya hii fanya hii fanya hii. I'm so sorry for your loss yeah. by the way. Pole Thank sana, you. pole sana. sana. Right. Sasa vile umesema wase wa come. Yeah. How first of all How can they reach you on social media so yeah. they can tell you hey Maze, I'm interested in helping out and reaching out What social media aje? social media pale Facebook Twitter Instagram at crazy monofonzi okay. kila mahali na javan oh mimi naweza nipata na Instagram javan jeri also Facebook okay so so okay before nini before we go any further let me ask what are your plans for what are your plans for this next two years Nini? yes okay. plans are for the next two years nasa sema plans are for the next two years nataka nataka ni kuwe a big gospel artist and going to happen so nasa sema nashukuru crazy amenishika mkono kama si single and industry hmm. single and story za ku travel kujua se media nasa sema pia namshukuru sana okay. amenishika mkono kutoka far by the way mm. Sasa sa. and how about you plans eh, for the next two years Me plans zangu za the next two years nataka nataka ni kuwa team nataka kuanzisha an empire I want to start an empire like how many people unajua like you become big when you uta lift watu wengine So nataka ku, by the next two years nataka ni kuwa build an empire that watu ni raise wanaweza stand on themselves na waweze kusikika na watu waweze ku appreciate kitu wanadu Hmm. Hiyo ndio goal yangu ya the next two years like hiyo ndio kitu nawakia sai like nataka tu ku build what like build 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 Both of you mnataka kusaidia wase Yeah ah, that's good that's, that's good me. So wrapping up this interview but before you go I've noticed something on your arm what's uh-huh. your tattoo about Yeah my tattoo Tattoo yangu ni all about my mom That's your mom That's my mom oh, Okay Tulikuwa so close yani mm. Tulikuwa so close so alafu ndio ile picha nilikuwa nayo yake Okay So niliona before ipo tena yake kwa mwili Ah yeah. Yeah, so mama anakuwa ngatu always na mimi. So every time mtu anabo oh, kitambia peke yako sisi tuko two in one. Hadi mm. naiboya anajua. Mm. Yeah, tuko ah. tu mama tuko two in one. Mm. Si mmesema support Kenyan music. Ndio. Sasa mimi mama tuko two in one. Ah sawa yeah. sawa. Ah that's amazing. Yeah. I've had such a blast with both of you on this show. Thank you. By the way, karibuni sana wa in the morning. Mm. It was good and I'm sure so of yours had a great time getting to know you guys. So please you're welcome to come once again. And remember you can always reach out to them on the handles that they gave you guys and as for me utanipata true joy underscore mochache and you know where to find Y254 channel as well. And signing out for See you guys later. Coming up is Youth and Politics with Hilda Wadidi.